budgeters welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well today i know i am and today i'm going to be doing my 52 week challenge stuffing as well as um on how do i say this <laughs> as well as taking out the remainder of my cash and my cash envelopes from the previous two weeks to see what we have left so let's see I have three dollars here I forgot which I believe they were from the personal I just can't remember okay from groceries I had a dollar which is good any amount of money from gas I had five dollars in change but it's change and then from personal I had five dollars as well so that is good a couple five dollars and then I have a whole bunch of change that I have to put in my piggy bank let me grab it all right here's my little coin let me get it out now this is not two weeks worth of coins this is actually four weeks worth of coin. I didn't take my coin out from the previous stuffing because I forgot about it. Look at that. A lot of change. So this is all my change right here. Got a dollar. So in total, I have $2.78, which is surprising. A lot of people, from being in the banking industry, I've noticed a lot of people don't care about the change and they like say, throw, sometimes I see people throw change like pennies on the ground and I'm like, what are you guys doing? That's free money. I mean, I'll take it if you don't want it. If I find a penny on the ground, I'm like, oh, that's for me. Hey money adds up like at my credit union my credit union that i um bank at mostly except for capital one um they have a free coin machine for their members so if i save up all this coin i'm gonna have at least my goal is to have at least 50 dollars worth of coins by the by the time this is filled up So that's my goal. It'll probably be, hopefully it'll be more, but that's how much I really hope I get. So we have one, two, three, four. So I got 10, so 14. I had $14 left over in total from my personal gas and groceries. And this is perfect because I can add them to my five dollar and dollar challenge which i have right here so we're gonna start with my dollar challenge and i had four dollars that i'm gonna be adding she's steadily growing guys steadily growing so i'm going to add four dollars right now i have one two three four five, seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen dollars so far which is pretty good seventeen dollars and i still have months to go so it's slowly but surely building up and then I have my $5 challenge now <laughs> I'm getting more fives 
So week five. So I am putting in $10. So that should give me 20. Because the previous I had 10. So right now I have $20. And she's like, I think much lower than the ones challenge. But it's still something and it's growing. So that's all I can ask for. Now we're gonna do the 52 week challenge, which we left that loft. I left off at 217 for the two week challenge. So it's gonna be week nine. We're gonna be adding $50. So that was the first one I pulled. And then week 10, it's gonna be 45. For the 10th, I'm going to take my cash that I took out. Okay, so I'm going to do the cash for my 52 week before anything else. So I had a 50 here. This is my personal, my gas money too. So I had 50 for the $50 and then I had 40 and here's a 45 so that's 95 in total. I'm gonna have to exchange these soon because they're getting thick on the envelope. All right. Here it is. Let me count it up. I'm probably gonna have to change the 50s for 100 soon. So we have 50, 1, 50. I always get confused with the 50s. So 150, 170, 190, 210, 230. 250, 260, 270, 280, 285, 290, 295, 3, 301, 302, 303, 304, 305, 306, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 312 is what I cut the what I added, but let me double check because um <laughs> The I might have been wrong with my math. So, so 312 is what I got. So I had previously 217 plus 50 plus 45. Whoa, I did my math right. It took me a second each time, but I got it. So 312 in just two months. I, I can't really say two and a half because it hasn't been half the month of March yet, but my 52 week challenge is growing. I'm so excited. Ooh, look at her. She's getting stuffed. I love it. All right. So total is 312. And when it gets closer to the end of the video, I will pull out the next two weeks um, challenge. How do I say this? The next two numbers for the next challenges. So now I have this. I have 20, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. All right. This is going to be going for my cash envelopes. Okay. So I think I'm going to have to get chained for my 52 week because I exchanged some money. I didn't get the right amount. So for my personal, I'm going to get 25, which I don't have. Hold on, let's see. 
Maybe it'll work out for me. One, two, three, four, five. So I'll use this 25. There we go. This is gonna be 25. And then 20 for gas. And this 10 was change for um, my coworkers and I, my coworkers and I, um, we felt we wanted to make our coworker feel better because, well, not feel better, but feel a little bit better because his mother just passed and we all pitched in some money and this came out of my gifts envelope. It was originally a 20 from last month, but I exchanged it for 10 and gave him $10 towards a gift card. We all pitched in some money for it. So I had to put this in my gifts envelope. So that washes everything out. I was wondering why I had an extra 10 and then I remembered. So now I'm gonna color this in just because I think it's fun. And let's see, what color will I choose? What color? Maybe this lime green will be nice. All right. So I'm gonna fast forward this just so you guys don't have to watch the painstaking <laughs> weight of it. But I am coloring the 45 and the 50, so. Okay, so that's two more jars filled and I'm so excited. I've gotten rid of 52 and 50 and 45, 42. I'm getting rid of all the 50s. I only have one more 50 to go, which is 51. And then it's all gonna be below the 50s. It's all gonna be 40s and below. So let me just, before I finish this out, I want to get the lower jar so that way you guys can, can see what the next two numbers will be for the next paycheck. All right, guys. So, pouring it in. This is from the lowest jar, which I forgot what it is, but it's definitely not going to be 40s and 50s. All right, it's going to be two numbers. Let's see. What's the first number? Nineteen. All right, that's not a low, low number, but it's still a good number. So nineteen is gonna be part of the next fifty-two week. So the second one. I think this is the first time I ever got anything below twenty. Right, next number. <laughs> I just jinxed myself. 24. So 24 and 19 is going to be, wow, it's going to be a total of $43 from my max paycheck. So these are the two numbers. At least I got one semi lowish number, but hey, if. Fate is saying you need to get the bigger ones out now so because something's going to happen in the future. I will follow Fate and do it. So $43 is going to be taken out. So these are the next numbers. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to hit that like button 
And if you'd like to join my YouTube family, please subscribe. I would love to have you a part of this crazy but fun-loving channel. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.